Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 20 of Let's Play Neo. Alright, I lessened my inventory to like less than half of max. By disassembling, offering, and selling a lot of my useless armor. So with that, we can move on to the Magatama of Fire. I've never done this submission before, so I don't know what to expect. But from the looks of things, there's no Kadama to find. I want to make stronger weapons. But for that, I need a stronger fire. That Omnio Mage you know told me that there's some kind of fire yokai in the silver mines of Iwami. Could I ask you to go there and take the source of their flames for me? Fire yokai? The only fire yokai I can think of is an Oni B and a Wheel Monk. Is it literally just fighting a Wheel Monk? I mean, if it's just a wheel monk, I can handle them. Given the terrain is, uh, respectful to me. Like, no long bridges where I can easily fall off. Ooh, I can level up again. Um... I'd say put another point in spirit. Maybe spirit? Yeah, let's go with spirit. Makes my guardian spirit bond even stronger. I also need to look at the other guardian spirits I just obtained. I already have all the bonuses for Isanade, which is very good. Daiba Washi actually has the best Amrita gauge rate with A+. A better evasion, equipment drop rate, and all that stuff. But, but, I'll be damned if I don't stick with this. Like, seriously. It's, the double pups have served me well. Oh, and there's one thing I forgot to do. I am going to change my Kodama Blessing to Healer again. There we go. Oh, this door is actually locked right at the start. I think I hear wheel monks. Or is it the poison I'm hearing? Oh god, it's this room. I remember this room. The door's closed on the other side. Hey, what the hell? I was gonna get my arrows ready first. No, oh, it's my time, not yours. God damn it. Oh, I knocked him down. But he didn't die. He wanted some of that smoke. <laughs> Try a new uh, melee type of weapon. What do I have that's any good? Nia's Tonfa. Well, Tonfa weapons are like the new weapons that came with the DLC. Obviously, I don't have any combos for it. I don't have any samurai skill points. Let's give them a try. Actually, let me give them a try when I get to get more skill points. Ah, that must be it.
Is that it? Did that stop the poison? I don't think it did. At least I don't think it did. Well, that did not go according to plan. Ah, oh, neither did that. Oh, come on! Play fair, alright? I guess I couldn't really do that, uh, charging move because I didn't have enough key. Oh! Okay, my poison meter is going down. Must be the last of them. Is it really? Yeah, it looks like it is. So I'm thinking that fire yokai might be where I fought giant centipede. be surprised. It's like I remember how the hell I got in that room. First. Of course, taunt fire is pretty much like really fast strikes, so they're not going to be strong. Might be able to stack element damage with them. Possibly apply an ailment. Because of those quick strikes. Oh, there's a ladder on this side. I hate that graves are like really close to the ladder. Because what if you activate one by mistake? Be real cautious with that. I was gonna get used to like when you're in low stance, the timing to get the key pulse is slightly different. But I can stick with this for a little while. Can I knock off demon horns like this? Yes, I can! I had to make sure I didn't fall off, fall down a hole. Oh! That's a sword job right there. That's a sword job. It's a regular encounter, too. So I might end up finding another one. But we did pretty well. Still getting Yamabushi apparel. Too bad it doesn't have a set bonus. Hi. Come at me, bruh. Oh wow, I didn't think I had that combo in high stance. I do that little tilt a whirl. I have an awful lot of stuff I don't use. Like those signpost talismans. They're only just there to tell you where to go in case you uh, die or get lost. 
the hell is this guy? Oh, just a skeleton warrior. I'm not worried. Whoa! Just suddenly got that strike. Open this door in case there's a disaster. There. That should help us out. So, yeah, it does appear I have to go back where I fought Giant Centipede. Is that really what it is? Actually, the machine to like uh, turn the uh, poison gas away is up here. Is there another one? Okay, that was not a good idea. Should be another one that turns away the gas. Uh, we got a problem. Put those back on the shortcut. Oh, I'm safe. Oh, I... I'm only safe in certain spots. On. Let me, uh, get rid of the poison. There's more. Is that all of them? I hope so. Oh, there's another one of those uh, machines. Whoa. Not cool, dog. Not cool. I did not consent to you sneaking up on me like that. And that is why I'm going to be a hypocrite. Oh, I thought I, I, thought I could just kick him. Not dead? Man, they can resist fall damage pretty well. Are you sure you want this? Maybe the yokai I need to kill is literally that smoke. Oh, wait a minute. There's more. It's actually at the end of this tunnel. Why have I not seen that before? It's this guy. Hi. Were you all surprised I would do this? Kagetsuchi's Magatama. We did it. That was not a long mission. Seriously. If you know where to go, you can just beeline right to it. Of course, it was all living weapon cheese anyway, so... Hey, the game gave me the tools. I am going to use them. Thank you, Anjin. 
I'm sure that Megatama will heat up the furnace if I put it in. Indeed, I can feel its heat from over here. I'll prepare everything in the smithy, so bring it along next time you visit. I'm sure I can be of even more help to you then. Oh, hang on, I got a phone call. Time out. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that uh, interruption, but it's all sorted. Alright, so that's my goods. A high-quality tamahogany, quality ingot, and quality wood. Why I couldn't just get high quality of this either? It's beyond me, but whatever. Now she said I can uh, get some benefits if I go back to the blacksmith. I handed over the Magatama. The Magatama has improved the blacksmith's forging capabilities. I guess it just allows me to make more stuff. Or it has greater odds of giving me the uh, good stuff. Like anything in exotic. So if I want to make a uh, an exotic Raikiri... I'm going to need six Tamahogany. And only uh, four of them are exotic. What if I made like... Um, two more like really good tamahogany that usually comes from weapons right it is weapons uh, I don't want to give up that one maybe this bandit axe yeah I think I'll get rid of this here uh, bandit axe I do have the black steel one that I normally use I'm gonna be giving up the earth damage and it's really good I'm gonna have to. I gotta let go. Okay, Raikiri. So, if I look at this carefully... Oh, I can only use like four of the same kind anyway. So I didn't even need to do what I did. Okay, I guess I'm just an idiot. Okay, let's take a look at our odds. I have highest odds of getting common. And 23% chance for uncommon. 25 for rare. And 23 for exotic. So that and uncommon is tied. Let's do it. Oh, I got yellow. <laughs> I got a trophy for it. Latest masterpiece. Apparently, I never did forging once when I practiced this. Um, I'll add it to the inventory, but I'm probably going to disassemble it right away. Yeah, this one can go. I mean, it's level 37. Maybe I can use it for soul matching. What I have now, it's level 31. I guess I could, uh, upgrade the sword. Yeah, I can give up my Raikiri to make it, uh... I mean, it'll lose its only three points of attack power, but it'll gain six levels. So you know what that Raikiri that I made that I was not a fan of? It found use after all. Oh! I should, uh... Let's take a look at special finds. You know what? I'll take this. I'm not going to equip it yet, but it could have its use. Okay, I don't really need to buy anything else. Alright, I guess I can go straight to the Ocean Roars again. I got nothing else to do. Let's do it. Those rumors of the ghost haunting Itsukushima have the crew scared stiff. 
We Kobayakawa may be masters of the sea, but our expertise doesn't extend to the supernatural. If you were to drive away this fearsome spirit, Sir Anjin, I would be happy to arrange a meeting with the Murakami. They should be able to repair your foreign vessel. I may even consider look, helping out Lord Ieyasu for your trouble. Alright, nine Kadama up for grabs. Let's go. Itsukushima, located in the Aki Domain, is a shrine built in the 12th century atop a basin of holy water, now contaminated by yokai energy to the point of ruination. The previous head of the Kobayakawa family, Takakage, took great pains to reconstruct and protect the shrines of the West, but Hideaki has proven himself not up to the task, and the area has now been infested by yokai and pirates. Now that's a double trouble right there. Yokai and pirates. <sighs> Too bad I didn't get exotic in this. Would make for a good matching set. All right, let me uh, pick a different one. Oh, this also had what? Some poison resistance. Oh, what do I go with? Ooh, I do like 16 points to luck and an extra defense multiplier. Oh, this gives me 24 to luck. Yeah, did I hit left by mistake? Oh, but it gives me extra familiarity. Yeah, let's go with this fan. I'll make good use of my fans. Okay, let's try our luck at this stage. So far, nothing too threatening. Hi. いらっしゃいましたね。秀明様の使いから話は伺っております。かのあやかしはこの一帯をねじろにしている様子。安治様、こちらをお持ちください。I got flint and a fire amulet. Hmm. This flint probably has some use. But for some reason, it's not showing up as a usable item. Ah, two flints can be struck together to start a fire. It is said that in Tsukushima, there still remain bonfires that dispel evil spirits. A soul style game using bonfires? No way. Who'd have thunk it? Looks like there's something over here. Like a little side road. Hi. Well, that guy's a pushover. Wow, your uh, aiming sucks. <laughs> Maybe you aim better without a head. I tend to talk a lot of trash for somebody that hasn't gotten this far in the game without dying once. Oh, there's another one. Is that the same boat? Right on, right above one of the eyes. Whoa, 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 I know, I know, I haven't parried in a while, but I'm just doing my thing and it's been working out. I like to keep it that way. And if that means some of my skills are gonna be rusty, so be it. Not a lot of water here, so I gotta be careful. Pretty sure I can't swim. Also, I haven't even prayed at the shrine yet. Oh, I can level up, too. So I shall. I'm level 48 already, damn. 
okay. I can get skill. Now go towards my Tonfa. Dexterity or magic? I think I should get more magic. Let's get more magic. Can I, uh, there's no booms, is there? Maybe I don't get the rest of these boons until I, um, finish the main story. Cassie's at 17. I'm gonna have to give up something. Let's give up wind. And I'm gonna try out that flying sword talisman. Betcha that look, looks badass. It reminds me of some of the Castlevania enemies. Oh, hold on, hold on. I know what I can do. I do have new bombs. Let's give up the Kayaku Damas. And bring in the Horoku Damas. He only gets to carry one less bomb. But it must be pretty good. Anyway, you know what? I think this is also a good time to stop here. And in the next episode, we will continue on with the Ocean Roars again. See you everybody. Thanks for watching.